Today we're going to be doing Uber, but this time it's going to be on a bike instead of the car. It's really noisy out here. Oh, that's not too far from here. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Fucking McDonald's. Here goes bullshit. And there's McDonald's. Look at this big old dog right here. Big old dog. Fairy and everything. Okay, Chris H. Okay. A whole hell of a lot faster than the rest of the orders I had. What was that? That's a whole hell of a lot faster than the rest of the orders I had. Oh, really? Alright. Yeah. Takes two of us. That's Chris right there. He picked up his food. Alright, so that one was uh, pretty good. Um, that customer was much quicker than the rest of them, so I give him a thumbs up. Down on not so much. I gotta go way across town. Alright, this looks to be the place. I guess 636. Go ahead and get this delivered and run back. So anyway, all right. So that'll be it for now. Got that order delivered. This way, yeah. Got the order delivered. And pretty much go. For so that. pretty much the day is over, and um, I'm looking at the weekly summary, or at least for Monday. It's actually 1:08 in the morning, and I made about 132 dollars, sort of, kind of. So. Um, my opinion is I wouldn't waste too much time on actually making money unless you actually have a car or a bike or something. That of which, that of which I use the bike. Um, I, I honestly don't know, but I mean, if you're unemployed and really need to get that rent paid or whatever it is, and you need to make like $100 a day, then definitely Uber is the way to go. But for you know somebody that's basically like me, I, I would I would really do this on the daily. And, uh, but if you have an electric scooter that you can invest in, definitely I would do that. It definitely is worth it. So if you hear a bunch of music in the background, that's actually, uh, I'm in Dunkin' Donuts right now. So this is a parking lot. No, not parking lot, but this is the um, 24 hour store. And there's not that many 24 hour Dunkin' Donuts in the city. So, but, um, for the most part, I'm tired and I'm gonna go to bed. I'm still in Manhattan. I have to travel at least another hour or so to get to Brooklyn and go back home and pass out. It's, it's a lot. To, to tell you the truth, at least for somebody like me, I have a big forehead, dude. If you were thinking about doing Uber or Postmates or DoorDash or Grubhub or something like that, um, and you really need to get some money in the pocket, I definitely would recommend it. But um, just don't depend it on it on it too much. Don't depend it. Don't be dependent on it too much because uh, the order is being sporadic. That's the issue with the 1099 jobs is the fact that uh, that it's not stable as it would be as if it was a W-2. So I don't know. I digress about that. I definitely would uh, look into it. Just not as a full-time job. Alright guys, I'll see y'all in the next video. Yeah.